Welcome back, everyone. Let's play some more Penumbra Black Plague. In the last episode, there's definitely somebody in here. And it doesn't sound very good. There's like some dude walking around in here with a flashlight. And I think that he doesn't mean good things to happen to us. So we need to find a way out of here. So let's check out that other room. There was one more room here. Uh, why is that turned like that? Wait a minute. I turned that that way. What the fuck is going on? This is like the r same room we started in. Oh no. doesn't look good at all. Okay. Well, at least that guy's gone. That's good enough for me. For the time being, I guess. That still won't move. Okay, well, there's something about that... Something with that syringe. We dealt with that, kinda, I think. I wonder. That guy's definitely still dead. That's a good sign, I, I guess. Nothing happens. Do you think? The syringe fits perfectly in the hole at the center, but nothing's happening. Oh, you don't think. Oh, come on, man. I gotta take some blood from this guy? I got an idea. Ew. I didn't like that noise very much either. That was gross. It says only trusted blood, though, and I imagine he was probably trusted. Oh, no. You can now enter the safe area, and I don't think I trust that as far as I can throw it. If this stronghold was anything like as elaborate as its security, I was in for an experience. I didn't know what to expect, but I was getting used to that. Oh, God. Yeah, that's just awesome. Another fuse box. This one seems to be broken. Yeah, I'm sure it is. I believe that's the master switch for the power. Hey, a note. Welcome to the shelter. A CD labeled welcome briefing. Okay, well, where the f where the shit is that supposed to be? <gasps> ow, ow. Excuse me. That light. It doesn't seem natural. Uh, that's wa that water? Am I underwater? Oh, great. I, I don't want to go in there yet. What the fuck was that? Why did it shake like that? Why did it shake like that? I don't know why it shook like that. I... I don't, I don't know I want to go down there or not. There's painkillers. That's good, I guess. Drainage of sorts. Uh, hey, there's a note. You're too late, sorry. We packed up and left today. It's been six months since we established this stronghold, and a year since we released the Turingate virus. Clearly there's no one coming to rescue us. We took a vote and decided to head for the old mine shafts this installation was built over. Right towards the start of the Troubles, one of the scientists got out that way. We haven't heard back from him, but you never know. The vote was 8 to 3 in favor. Anyone returning to this point, I suggest you do the same. There couldn't be more than a few survivors out there, even now, and more and more of our number are disappearing, losing it or getting infected. You can make it out via the sewers, then into the shafts. Eventually, we'll all have to find a way up and through the ice. We may yet die of cold, but it's better than what happened to Gray. The only person that may be still out there is Howard. 
kind of our leader. He left the base a few weeks ago, and that's part of what led us to this. He'd converted the kitchen into an office and was translating some old texts when he claimed he found a way to counteract the disease. I guess he didn't make it. Amabel Carlito, sous chef. Great. Just great. Well, according to that, this is we can get out through the drainage. How, I... How, I don't know. Not to mention that we can't seem to pick this thing up. Uh, I guess that means I have to try this. It sure is locked tight. Okay. Okay. Uh, that's obviously still broken. Uh... Okay, well, we have reached a small impasse here, because we, we still don't have a weapon of any kind. And by that I mean we literally have zero. No hammer, no nothing, except for more effing batteries for something that we still can't freaking use. A barrel from the smell, I'd have to say the crap inside is drenched with gasoline. Oh, great. Well, wait a minute. Um, I'd love to have a lighter right now. That'd be pretty cool. But, you know, why would we ever have one of those when we need it? Anything? Anywhere? Please? No? Great. Yeah, I need to start thinking straight too, but, you know, what the hell else am I supposed to do? Um... What the shit? God forbid I try this. Nope. Nothing doing, of, of course. Of course. I kinda don't wanna go back out there. I really, really don't. But I don't really have a choice. Apparently this door is controlled from a remote location, however it says it does open in an event of an emergency. What kind of freaking emergency are you talking about? There's gotta be something going on here. really frustrating. <sighs> All right. Now well, we sure are getting nowhere here. I really mean nowhere. Um, you know, this is really not doing it for me right now. It's really not. I just want to get in here. I can't possibly imagine stacking boxes on that's going to do anything. Um... Okay... Still not really getting anything out of this at all. Uh, 
I don't suppose that throwing a chair at that's going to do anything either. Nope. Oh. Okay, well, I guess in light of this, we're going to have to wait for the next episode of Let's Play Penumbra Black Plague, and we'll have to figure out just how in the hell we're gonna get out of here. I just, I can't seem to figure it out. So, just you wait. We'll figure it out. So I'll see you then.